and welcome to my channel. So today I thought we might take a look in the basket of knitted mates. It's rather full as you can see. I probably need a new basket actually. So who do we have in here? Well, this little lady. Did I cross right? This is Genevieve. She comes from one of the Ronald stories and she's all made with her nice pinky ears and uh, a little brooch. It's a bead. It's a brooch. So that's Genevieve. Who else have we got? Uh, this new character for you. This is Danny the bus driver. You've not met him in the stories yet, but he will be coming in. He's got his uniform on, his dark blue trousers, his blue top, and his blue tie. All different blues. This is Danny the bus driver. Who else do we have? Well, this is Barbara. So Henry must be around. Henry and Barbara. So they come from another Ronald story. They're a couple that Ronald meets. So that's Henry and Barbara. Looks like Ronald fell off at one stage. We all know Ronald, don't we? <laughs> this is our Ronald. Who else have we got? We've got Ronald's hair. Oh, there's a Mrs. Ronald. Now, she was wearing that outfit when she went to Turkey, wasn't she? That's in the Turkey story. But it's, it's also a dungarees, so it will become into other stories as well. Who else do we have? So this is the original Mrs. Ronald. She's in near enough all of the stories, isn't she? Dressed like this as the helper with her pinny on. And she helps out Ronald in lots that he does. Who else do we have? Oh, there's another Ronald in there. Ronald in his black dungarees that time. Or this time. But um, he's our Ronald and he's got his tashes and he's got his ears and... His tail on the back. They've all got tails because they're mice, aren't they? So they're going to have tails. Who else have we got? Now this, or these, are Ronald's helpers. Now they've come in in a couple of the stories and they'll be coming in again. So this is Bill. He's got a B. Helps me know that it's Bill. This is Rex. And this is Tony. So it's the three helpers that all come up in the Ronald books. Who else have we got for Ronalds? Ah, yeah. Mr. Dimple the Vicar. Looks like he's, <laughs> his whiskers are going for a bit astray there. But they are there. Mr. Dimple the Vicar. There's lots of Ronald characters. And this one you haven't met yet. He's Perry the Plumber. And Perry the Plumber, I'll just get actually has his own box of tools. How about that? He's got hammers, he's got scissors, he's got screwdrivers. So Perry the plumber has his tools. And actually, Mrs. Ronald, when it comes into it, Mrs. Ronald has her own cooking utensils and trays and flour and eggs. So that'll be on show with Mrs. Ronald. Now I did see somebody jump down the back. Let me go and see what we've got down the back. There we go. It's another Ronald. <laughs> Can't ever have too many Ronalds, can we? So who else is in the basket? Ah, now this is Jamie. Now if you listen to Jamie and his friends and his little cat called Alice, this is Jamie. Very colourful top. And they're actually... Two Jamies. There's a pink Jamie and a white Jamie. Both got the tops on though. Obviously enjoyed making Jamie, so I made two of him. Now the other ones in the bat in the basket are just little collectibles I've got. So we've got a white mouse. We've got a grey elephant. Cute one. What else have we got? Oh, there's a Peter Rabbit. Beatrix being one of my favourite storytellers, Beatrix Potter. We've got a Jiminy Cricket. Everybody likes Jiminy Cricket, don't they? 
Who else have we got? Ah, now, you'll know this one. It's Woody. He's made his way into the basket. <laughs> Lots of different ones. Yep, Dumbo. And these are all coming out. There's lots of them, aren't there? Oh, this was just a little pretty sheep that I'd found when we were on holiday one time. And I thought, oh, cute. She'll go in my basket. What else have we got in here? Ah, Gus from Cinderella. How many of you got a Gus? Gus is always good. We've got a little bear, a little white bear. Jesus loves me. And he's got his own little Bible. Quite cute. I thought he's nice for in there. All right, so we've got another Nelly. You can tell I like elephants. And this one was given to me by one of my nephews or nieces. <laughs> and it's an auntie elephant. Else have we got? Oh, this one was good. I think this one makes a noise. I'm sure, he made a noise. A mick mick, isn't it? Can you hear him? <laughs> and we've got a teddy with a bee on his nose. You can see why it was rather tall. There's so much in here. There's a handmade one of mine, a teddy. Lots of colours. I do like colour. What else have we got? Oh, we've even got a yoda in there. I wonder how he found his way in there. <laughs> it's not a soft toy, but he's a Yoda. So obviously he wanted to go in. Small Power Ranger. There's all sorts of things in this basket. Oh, I think these were called Layla's when they were first came out. Just knitted. They've got like a rather long tummy. Long arms. This one's got a scarf and some pretty little bows on her. They don't seem to have much on their face. They just have eyes. But that's fine. What have we got left? Ah, now these are two very old scarecrows. You can see these have been around for some time. Now this was my stepmum Jean's. And she gave me this one from the scarecrow family. So he stay with me. You can sit back in there. And this was another one that I'd found, not one of mine that I'd made, but one I'd found, probably in a car boot or an antique show or something. So it's like, I've got Mr. and Mrs. Scarecrow. Look at the bees. <laughs> Looks like he wants a bit of repairing, doesn't he? He's fallen off of there. But they're quite old, these two. And there you go. One empty basket. The fun will be for me to try and put it all back. <laughs> I do hope you've enjoyed this share with all my different bits and pieces in the basket. Hope to see you soon again. And I uh, wonder if Mick Mick's going to work. <laughs> Just about. So here's the next time. Let's see what I can find for next time. Take care. Do subscribe. And do like my channel. Bye bye for now.